Hello friends, welcome back to the Craft Castle. Today I have a little Etsy tip for you. I'm super excited to share with you this app that I've been using for many, many years. It is called Get Vela. I use it to list all of my items, do all my SEOs. It is a paid for app or a paid for website, but I 100% think it is so worth it. I think it's about like five, 10 bucks a month, but 100% totally think it's worth it. And I'm going to show you one of the really cool features of why I like to use this, this website. They call it an app, but it's actually a website. So you can't use it on like a phone. It's not like a phone app. You go to a website and you link your Etsy shop into the Get Vela app. And there's a lot of really, really cool features. I'm going to get into some of them as the weeks progress. But one particular one that I am going to show you today is editing a picture. And I know that sounds like super, super simple to you, but I'm gonna show you something that I just cannot wait to show you. The other thing too that I like using for this before we get into the actual app is I was asked if you come over here into one of my birthday banners, how come in one of my variation boxes, I get like extremely long variation boxes for my characters. If you do this in the Etsy website, you only get, I think like, a maximum of 20 characters, but over on the Get Vela app, I get a whole bunch of more characters. That is because I'm using this app slash website and I'm not using the actual Etsy website. So that is one of the benefits as well to this. There are also a ton more benefits, but I love being able to use more characters than what Etsy allows me to use. Okay, so going back into the real reason why I brought you here today, is this particular listing. I don't know what it is about this listing, but I get asked all the time, can this be a different age? Can it be 40, 21, 18? You get the picture. I don't know what it is, but this particular listing, is, I always get the message. However, in here it says, add your personalization, leave your note, leave your age. So for me as the seller, I feel like, duh, of course I can. But to buyers, they just keep asking. So in order to alleviate this, the buyer's gonna ask a question and then have to wait for the answer, which a lot of times the art of selling is, is if a buyer has to ask a question to the seller and therefore wait, they aren't going to do that. They want to know right away if what they're getting can be customized to whatever age. If they have to ask a question, chances are they're just gonna keep looking for a different seller that for sure they know can have the age customized. So that's just the art of selling. Okay, so I have this listing. I don't wanna have to edit the pictures. I don't even know if I have them saved in my computer or in my phone. You get the picture. If I go over into the Get Vela app, I actually, the other cool thing about the Get Vela app is that I can link my Shopify stores and all my Etsy stores all together in one spot so I can list this stuff and do all of my edits on the listing on one website versus doing it continuously three different times. If you have three different websites or three different selling platforms, you're gonna have to do this step three times. Instead, in the Get Vela app, you can do it all on one website. So going into that very first picture, I am going to click right here and do this like edit button. You can Remove the background if you wanted to. Just click that background. Oops, let me make myself smaller. Click remove background. And there is the completely moved background. Now we can go ahead and change this over into white if we wanted to. You can change this into any color that you want. For me, I am not going to make that white. I like the darker background for this for this cake topper. So I'm gonna leave it the way it is. I'm gonna go down into promote and then I'm gonna click on these. Like you can choose what you, you know, like if you wanted to offer a sale or anything like that, you can choose that. You can do a header. You can even add your own in there if you wanted to. I am going to then just do like a patch. And instead of saying sale, I'm gonna make this just you can rearrange this any way you want. Instead of making this sale, I'm gonna do any age needed. Oops, and it's getting real big. So we're gonna resize this to where it's a little bit smaller. Okay, 
Now, I don't really like that it kept getting bigger into the circle, so I'm just going to make this, this one right here. Let me drag this over. And you can just resize this to however you want it to look. Ooh, let's do this down at the bottom. More like that. Okay, then you can change your uh, lettering if you want. Again, you can add your own in there. So if you have like a saved for on brand, if you had something that was on brand that you wanted to save in here, you could totally add that in yourself as well. But I'm just going to add in whatever. I'm just gonna choose a font and then I'm gonna go over here into edit and I'm gonna change the color. If you have brand colors, this is where you would add that in there as well. I'm going to make it, let's see. I'm going to change this white, change the font to black. So then it looks like it's meant to be there. But I don't want it to cover my, there we go. Okay, so I'm just gonna leave it like that. And then press save. So then when you do that, we're gonna go over into Move Me, and then right here is Publish, and I'm just going to publish it. I'm only gonna publish it to my um, Etsy listing, because that's where the question normally happens. If you wanted to, you could change this over into all of them, like I previously said. Okay, now it says Publish. We're gonna go over here into my original listing and press reload and there it is it says any age needed so now when people click that they obviously can see it says any age needed and there's no longer going to be a question of can this be a different age now in the weeks to come i will have a little bit more tutorials for you it is a super easy app to use and navigate but i definitely think it's worth it especially if you are a serious seller on etsy or shopify they do offer a few other platforms as well but they are rolling out a whole bunch more like ebay and amazon as well all right y'all i sure hope i made your life a little bit easier being an etsy seller and i will see you later